All right, get ready for some delicious food and fun. Jacksonville's Tacos and Tequila Fest returns this upcoming Labor Day weekend. The festival kicks off on September 2nd at Metropolitan Park. That's right. So we have some guests here with us. We have Jordan Mixon and we also have Charles here with us as well. Thank you guys for joining us. A lot of people are excited about this. So tell us what people can expect when they come out to the festival. Yeah, um, so we're going to have over 40 different culinary teams showcasing over 100 different tacos. We'll have over 45 different tequila distilleries from Mexico that will be showing off over 120 different types of tequila. We're going to have art and entertainment zones throughout the park, and it's going to be unbelievable for the city. Awesome. So, Jordan, talk to us about uh, what kind of guests will be at the fest this year. Well, I have the pleasure of curating some wonderful visual artists that are going to be installing these beautiful art installations. We're having a variety of different muralists celebrate a variety of themes like Hispanic culture, Jacksonville culture, and we're bringing in artists like Sean Thurston, who's a prolific muralist here in the Jack Jacksonville community, Elena Olander, a returning artist, and many more. So, cannot wait to share. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, awesome. so we cannot ignore this beautiful no. set that we have going on here. So tell us about what we have and um, can we expect to see any of these and the significance it holds to the event? Absolutely, yeah. So you will see all of these tequilas at the event. Um, some of them, uh, like this one right here, is a very, very rare bottle. Uh, only a couple hundred were imported into the state of Florida and we'll have several of them at the festival. This is a uh, very unique Jaguar tequila. Um, Ooh, this is Maestro Dobell's um, Cristalino. Look at that. And um, yeah, lots of tequila. Well, I love the sound of that. So, Charles, I know that a big announcement is coming, but I kind of twisted your arm. Can you break it here on the show? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> okay. So, if you're a boater and wanting to attend the festival, you'll now be able to attend the festival. We're adding in a marine dock. Um, and marine entrance so that way you can ride the river taxi or come by boat. Uh, dock space will be limited um, but the weekend is going to be unbelievable. Big Boy is going to be performing on Sunday Wow! Hey. and we're excited <laughs> for him. Um, Iration on Saturday with uh, Gym Class Heroes also on Sunday and uh, Lupe Fiasco on Saturday. Wow so, so. clearly this is yeah. going to be packed so is our yeah. tickets still available? Limited tickets are still available. Um, we've sold out of some of our VIP options, um, but there still are some options available. Okay. And it all benefits charity. Yeah, absolutely. We love that so much. So I know you mentioned about all these different type of tequilas here. So when people get to the festival, what can they expect? Can you break that down for us if you could. Well, we're going to have a variety of different activations. We're going to have cooling stations. There will be a Taco disco um, section. Oh, it's going to be amazing. Okay, taco disco. Wait, mm -hmm. tell me, tell me what that means. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know how silent discos are really popular here yeah, in Jacksonville. Yes, they are. Take that and multiply it times ten. Okay. Hey, okay. okay. I like how that sounds. I get that. I get you. I get you. Wow. Okay. And we also have a variety of fun merch too that's coming okay. up. Um, yeah, there's going to be a lot of different um, shirts and hats and souvenir glasses, as well as some fun socks. <laughs> okay, so any advice for people who have never been here before? I've actually never been. I think I'm going to go this year. Mm -hmm. So do you, should you arrive early? Any tips that you guys have for anyone, for any newcomers? Yeah, uh, gates open at noon. Um, parking will be available in lot J. Um, and you can also come by boat. Um, the gates, once gates open at noon, the festival goes to 11. Um, normally it's more family friendly um, during the day. Um, we have a lot of cultural music planned as well, as well as cooking demonstrations, dance lessons, um, and we have five different large tents so people can escape the heat. That is awesome. All right, sounds good. Thank you guys so much for being here with us on this Saturday morning. We really appreciate it. Yes. <laughs> Thank you.